What's up, it's your boy Guy Trevor back at it again with Paper Mario in the Thousand Year Door. I did what could only be considered very fast grinding. So here's what happened. I'm level 38 now. I'm a superstar, which means the stage is different, so you get to see that. You would not have been able to see that had we just gone to the uh, just kind of end of it, because I would not have been this high level. Because uh, it. If we just done the rest of the game normally, we would not have seen everything there is to see. That said, <laughs> that is nice. The reason we have 99 badge points is because we went to Kill Hall Key, and we equipped the badges, chill out. Speaking of chill out, <laughs> she's playing over there with a bunch of stuff hanging from my door. It's like uh, old ID badges and lanyards. I'm really having a blast. <laughs> no, keep going, please. Anyway, so we went to Keel Hall Key, equipped the badges, uh, HP Drain, uh, HP Drain P, uh, yes, HP Drain and HP Drain P, uh, which I'll just show it over here. Do -do -do. So these two drop your attack by one, regain one hit point per attack. With our level, that means that we basically just are going to regain one hit point per attack. With chill out, we never succumb to a first strike, which means we always go first. And with uh, Goombella as our partner, you just kind of mash A while doing something else off screen. And you will just ever so slowly gain a star point every single battle over and over again. And when I was a kid, I would just let that, I would, I had a, a turbo controller from GameStop that I would tape the A, a button down and just let that shit run for hours while I was at school. <sighs> Those are the days. That said, it is cheating. It is cheap. It is an exploit. But in order to do that and not have my playtime be disgustingly higher than it should be, to give about a good impression of how long we've been really playing, uh, what I did instead was I mean, look, the playtime is actually even higher than it should be now because it was on a fast mode for a while there. But what I ended up doing was uh, using an action replay code as is apparently the staple of all of my Let's Plays except for the Dark Souls one where you literally can't cheat. Uh, well, I mean, you can, but it's hard. So I didn't. I don't want to. Uh, I used it to make easy level up, which is basically just every battle will give you one star point while you have 99 uh, star points left, so you just get a level up every single battle. So I did that to make it go a bit faster, to keep everything a little bit more in line, because the only thing I skipped was the time sink. Because I was sitting there for about five minutes or so, just holding down the A button with the turbo controller going, with the speed limit turned off so everything was like, woo, going super fast and shit like that. That said, <laughs> so yes, now we have 99 badge points. We're level 38, that's supposed to be where we were last time, we got the superstar. And let me show you what my badges look like now. The badges that I equipped were Ice Power and Timing Tutor, just because they were nice things to have. Uh, we have just, I equipped the Happy Flowers, so that we will slowly and automatically restore just uh, a flower point, you know, during battle, here and there. Just every turn, hopefully every other turn, who knows, we'll be restoring just a single flower point, which would be nice. Uh, I also equipped Zap Tap because I know there are bats in the place that we're going and I don't want to deal with them. Uh, I equipped Feeling Fine and Feeling Fine P because they're fun. I also equipped HP plus P twice, which probably don't actually need. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, 35, 40, 35, 45, 40, 40, 50 hit points for Bobbery. Good lord, that's unnecessary. I mean, look, with our, like, 30, we actually didn't even need that. Um, then quick change, yeah. You know what? What I wanted to do to make this interesting was have just the partner out front to basically take to take care of everything. You know, like our partner would be like the the big tank or whatever. Uh, while we not use Mario actually that much. So instead of HP plus P, we equip 
We could equip two defend plus Ps to make our partner invincible and put them out front. Uh, hmm. Make Mario immune to poison and dizziness. Let's not equip those. Well, no, let's keep those equipped. They will be useful. Let's equip a flower saver, because that would just be nice to have. We don't need lucky start. That's fine. I'm... Really considering just having these two FT plus badges on, I think that might be actually a little bit more fun. Because uh, that'll just mean more flower power that we can use. Peekaboo is not useful. Happy Heart, I don't actually want. It's just the the restorative is just too slow. Damage dodge, however, damage dodge is actually interesting. P up D down, you have my attention. Mm hmm. Hmm. Doubling up on Unsimplifier might be fun, except we never actually use star power, so... I mean, we do, it's just not very often. But, you know, it's been six minutes of me fucking around with badges, so let's just do... this. Let's put the two FP pluses, right, and we have two left over, that we can put on... P down, D up for Mario. Or we can make Mario a little bit more hectic. Let's make Mario a little bit more hectic. Let's make it a little bit harder. We could make it a lot more harder. We can make it a lot more harder. Oh my god, we can make it a lot more harder. Okay, let's see how this goes. Just as like a penance for cheating, you know? Let's see how this goes. This will probably end poorly. But, we're now at the thousand year door. Spooky scary. There's Frankly. Oh lord, he coming. Let me just save real quick, because I will likely die rather, rather quickly. God, I actually should go to a store. What I should do is go to a store and change some of it. By the way, there was a jam and jelly uh, in the place with Keel Hall Key where I'm like, there's that one block that I need to hit sometime later. That block was empty. If you super jump, while standing on top of the little platform that Yoshi kind of goes across to and then has to go across again, there's a jam and jelly hidden there, which is interesting. I guess. That's at 30 flower points. That's gonna be more fun. Or capture Mario. Well, it doesn't matter now. I don't think they're in the vicinity anymore. They must have found another way to get through the door. Did they? Hmm, that door looks pretty well closed to me. It's all come down to this. Hurry now, Mario. Hold off the last crystal star. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, what's the other side of the wall look like? It's plain. Okay. I mean, you could have put a design on there, because we'd only be able to see it in this exact cutscene. Regardless. Fun. Hmm, look, the door. Oh dear. Oh no. Now. Oh. Ooh, yikes. That doesn't look good. Some wide open doors, huh? Oh, was his partners in time? At long last, the entrance to the Palace of Shadow has been opened. Before Princess Peach falls victim to that fiend, before he takes over the world, you must rescue the princess to stop this cataclysm. I'm with you, Mario. Oh yeah. I should stop at a shop and grab some fucking stuff. Uh, good idea, actually, me. Let's let's. No, this doesn't go to a shop. This does not go to a shop. I feel like I know where a shop is, but let's go to a shop. And try again. I did bad. Hey, here's the thing, I did bad. Uh, I still need to find those last four star pieces, and I actually don't believe they're in the Palace of Shadow. question is, where are those last four star pieces? Because they're necessary to get another 
pow up or attack up for Mario or whatever, which is interesting, but also yeah. We don't need it. It's fine. Now something I also want to point out here is that we have 99 badge points, and yet we still can't equip everything that we want to. And it caps there. That's the cap. You can't equip more than that. So, yeah. That's again why I didn't feel terribly bad about that, because it's not like, oh, now we're so powerful because we are just inundated with shit. Okay, that's sad. Uh, I would like to store two items. What do I actually not want? Um, mm, mm. One's that special. Put the Keel Mango away. And I want the chocolate cake. I do not want the jam and jelly with me. What I would like is to withdraw. Not the shroom, not the rage. Not the whack a bump. Maybe the whack a bump. Maybe the whack a bump. Zest Deluxe? No. Uh I want life shrooms. Give me Give me the two life shrooms over in here. That really should be it. Um, super shroom, I guess? Yeah, sure, why not. Okay, this should be fine. Everything else... Now, maybe hopefully Mario will actually start using items. <laughs> That's the... That is the hope here. That said, we still have 500 coins. If you ever wanted to do anything with those. I know I don't. But, let's go back. Now, something I could do here, and I'm actually kind of debating it, is I could go down my HP to 10, which would be a shit idea, so let's not do that, actually. But yeah, I was gonna say, yeah, I could, I could down my HP to 10, give myself uh, a bit more FP, and then see how things go from there. But no, I mean, 20 is, 20 is good. Let's keep, let's keep on with 20. Okay. Into the Palace of Shadow. And the doors close behind us, for some reason. Clunk. Chapter 8. The Thousand Year Door. Ooh. What decorating? Spooky music, too. What an unpleasant place, but we don't have a choice in the matter. We have to get in there and save Pete before this gets any more out of hand. Let's go, dearie. Oh, yeah. Mm, no treasure. Not off to a good start. This is some music, eh? A stopwatch, because I know there's treasure. And that was the only treasure in here. In this entire, and you will see, gigantic room. We made Mario stronger. Mario does 10 damage with his jump now. These things have 9 hit points. I wanted to make my partner a beast, and I appear to have made Mario just unstoppable, I guess. <laughs> Yoink. Man, I almost wish there was like another another flower finder, you know? So here's the thing. They each have nine. Uh Goombella, I know. He's able to headbonk for nine. Cool, cool. We'll head bomb for 10. And we can jump for 10. Strong, very strong. Off to a good start. Battles have so far not lasted more than one turn, so we're just getting a lot of use out of our, uh, out of our, um, our happy flower. 
Ooh, you had stuff on you. Okay. Let's just do this, because why not? Even with even with timing too. Now watch this. <laughs> well, I mean, you watched and saw our lucky uh, picking effect because I believe it's over 50 at this point. We have three lucky day, which is each 10 with diminishing returns, plus 25 from lucky day. Oh, jeez, it's. Again, you say you don't smell anything. I feel like you should be, though. And then there's this room. A shooting star! Sure, why not? And some dry bones. Which we encountered in the, uh... That lowers their defense. That lowers their defense, but you don't need that. Let's spin jump. Lovely. She can't actually love slap that, which means we did the wrong one. Uh, swap over to... They have a defensive two. Gubella won't do it. Tyree won't do it. Vivian won't do it. Uh, well, I guess we're just where we are now. Tease? Sure. What is the timing on this? Oh, it's while she's in the flip afterward, okay. Ow. Okay. Absolutely fantastic. And another Subella, or Su Vamp Vampire, something like that. I don't know. It's like a kid to bed. All good. You aren't good. Good for us. This is very thick fog. That's a weird noise. Ow. See, the thing is, is that hurt real bad. Ah, we're invincible. Bonk for 12, and it's like, ooh, right, double pain. Forgot about that. Ooh, yikes. Oh, forgot about double pain. We're gonna keep Miss Mouse out here, actually. I had forgotten about double pain. No, I'd rather you didn't, actually. Here's the thing, I'd rather you didn't. What should we do? How about you, Bombast? This should do enough to kill everyone. Oh, like, perfectly, too. Well, missed. Missed on that one. That's what I did. Yo, yay, okay. So, you, Bombast. That dude's holding that can, I see it. Just perfect. Very FP intensive though. I'm not a fan of that. Then again, things have not been going on long enough for that to matter. Ooh, these are new. Give my love you, please. I jumped over it. I would like to jump on one. There we go. That's what I wanted. And he's dead. He's dead and we killed him. Tattle, please. On this cool new enemy. That's a bombshell bill. Oh boy. B bill blasters. Shoot these things repeatedly. Attack is HP is 3, attack is 6, defense is 2. 
attack is high, but its HP is low, take it out before it takes you out. Then again, if you focus on these guys, you'll never win, and smack the, smack the blaster. So, a defense of two, we're still doing three for these bounce. That said, they will hit me for 12, and I will die. I will die if that hits me. Shit. Like that. Show oh, fuck. Things got rough real quick. Things got real rough. Okay. I think I see a badge that might be worth putting on there. Uh, badges. Equip badges. Let's unequip. Mm. I want to keep the FD down. Uh, 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 mm. I just need one. Feeling fine P. We won't need the feeling fines for a while yet, so that's fine. Well, what I do want though, here's the thing, what I do want is a uh, really good, just what I want. <sighs> God. Chill out is what I want. I want chill out. I don't want first attack. I don't want some fire on some water. I want... Doubling up on the damage dodges. Because I want to keep double paint on. I want to actually make this difficult for me. Without making it, you know, too terribly difficult. Um, how about... What's our 3 BP that we can equip? Uh, how about we actually do... Say yes to the dress with an HP+. plus. How's that sound? I have two hit points. I have two whole hit points. Fuck. Oh boy, I'm gonna need to get those back. Cause I'm gonna die. Hmm. Maybe worth using an HP restoring item. Who knows? You know, whatever those are. But, okay, I'll get close to these dudes eventually. Still in danger. Didn't do that one right. Oh, right, I forgot. Sweet Feast, that's an option. I forgot about that. But then they were only trying to get Mario's hit points. No, hold on. It wasn't enough. We need Vivian. That's what we need. I'm also not looking for, like, coins. I'm not necessarily looking for hearts and flowers. I'd rather just have Vivian out here, honestly. But I'm gonna need Goombella for the blaster. Okay. Bella. Boink? Is that even gonna do anything? Boy, that's a lot of <laughs> that's a lot of defense. That's like four. Goodbell if you please. B Bill Blaster, fires bombshell bill. Sorry about the abbreviation. HP is ten, defense is four, it's really, really tough. Yeah, that's hard to hurt this guy. The thing is if you don't take it out, it'll keep shooting bombshell bills at you, so you gotta figure out a way to beat it and fast. What if I perhaps use Tyree next turn? <laughs> yeah, okay, so swap partners to Tyree. Tyree will be effective next turn. What if this turn I used a shooting star? No, I will not do that. No, I will use piercing blow. This is what I will do. Oh, he shot, he did it. That, he done did it. I can't gulp. Oh, I could gulp. What I want to do those. Here's some blow. That guy. Yeah. Getcha. Stylish. I will die if I don't kill this. So swap over to Bella. Bella head bonk. Thank you, Bella. 
Oh, you fought two of them. Two of them, though? You did shoot two of them, though. So if I swap over to you, and... Uh, mm, mm, mm. Vivian, could you do me a favor and, um... Infatuate would be fun to confuse them. No, fire your drinks, please. Press the button too early. Seven damage, though. Not bad. Also, that seemed to have gone through its defenses, which is good for me. Oh, yikes. Okay, back over to you. Oh, boy. Oh, I want that. And the... I want, th I want that, though. Good. It doesn't disappear, I believe. It's also right on top of some fucking spikes. You... You need to be stopped, is the thing. Okay. That's another spare point for us, followed by... There it is. All or nothing. Hit action commands. Fail, attack rises. HP, but if you fail, the attack drops to zero. So, that is a 4 BP badge. Because if you hit an action man, your attack drops by one, but if you fail, it drops to zero. Now, we could combine this with our two unsimplifiers to just really have a bad time. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, poor coops. Okay, just go slow. Does that count as me hitting them, or what? What happened here? Oh, it's just a normal dude. Yeah, I'd rather have my current setup. I believe that's going to be more fun than all or nothing. Since all or nothing basically just means if you don't hit the action menu, you waste a turn. I think this is a more fun, kind of masochistic approach. It's like being a fucking flower yet. Yeah. Is there any other treasure in here, by the way? There is not. Okay. Good. Fine. I'm glad. <sighs> a jump. Secret. Stylish. Hooray. I feel like we got a lot of star power. Oh, we got a lot of star power because of our superstar side stage. Oh, yeah, she's jumping because there's the items right there. I thought I had Coop's book for some reason. So that's not the way. Seems this is the way. How old? And a nice little save block, just for us. Which I think is the perfect time to go do something else. <laughs> now, next episode, we are going to be our next time we are going to be going through the second part of the Palace of Shadow. There are many parts. This is a big ass space. Peace.